Hey guys, it's Derek, Children's Pastor from Lakewood Christian Center. I'm going to teach you guys how to do this uh, SpongeBob trick that we did to talk about uh, working in the ministry or working in leadership. Uh, the first thing to note is you really don't need these particular sponge balls. I would suggest that all you really need is multiple sponge balls and then larger sponge balls. So you just, all you want to do is multiply your sponge balls, then make them join together to get a little bit bigger. And this was just an added in thing. If you've got the square, you know, you can go ahead and, and do that extra thing that Dodo did talking about the ministry and the church and how to, how to deal with it. And then, of course, you want to get to a point where you do a big one. You want to kind of wow them. Now, of course, I'm not being careful with these, so you can probably see how some of these work. But anyway, to do the uh, first little thing, I, I really, Dodo was, uh, was kind of doing it. Um, really wasn't a method, but he had uh, all three of these sponge balls in this hand, and then one in this hand. And so these were all crunched up in here. And when he would put this up and he would point to uh, the sponge ball like this, he'd take one of the sponge balls here and drop it in his hand. And I'm talking anyway. So you're like this. You actually got a sponge ball in your hand like this, and one right there. Right there. So then you, I, he, he turned his hand like this, went down, and as you go down, you bring your hand up because you're going to rub this one, but what you're really doing is bringing the other sponge ball up, and you make it look like you press this one in and you rub it until they, it looks like you're kind of cutting it in half, but what you're really doing is just revealing the second one, so then you've got two. And you put one down, do the same thing again, take that point, and you drop this in your hand, same thing second one. Do it to all four. And then these were in this pocket over here. So we had these two out. Alright. These are in this pocket. So you take up two. You hold them out as you're taking up these two and you're holding them out. You reach in your pocket and take this one while they're looking at these two. And you ball this up in this hand. You've got these two in your hand. And they'll jump out. Maybe it would be better if you it's something more like this, but you really want to do something more like this because in the move that you're going to do here, you're going to take this and seemingly put this in your hand like so, but it's now it's this one. What you're really doing is you go to put this in this hand, open this, put your fingers back, drop it into this fist, pull it out like you took out those balls. And then you drop these two in this pocket and reveal this one. You do the same thing here. So you hold these up, steal this one as you're holding them up, come down, pinch them together, go to put this in this hand, you're really switching it out, boom, reveal that. Put this in, these, in this pocket. Alright, now the, these are special. The, the, the square one is special. It has a hole in it. You don't ever want to reveal that it has a hole in it. And to prepare for this, I take my ball here, and I just, if you have one of these, you should know how to use it, but you just kind of roll and turn it inside out so that it looks like a ball. And so you take this out, you show it like it's a ball, and then you're going to take these two, and what you're going to do is kind of make a funnel with your hand and take these two and press on it so that what's happening is, and I'm going to try and do this with my fingers open, what's happening is, is you're actually turning it from inside out to right side out so that it reveals like that. That actually looked really cool. But um, So then you've got this. And you can talk about the ministry, and what I like to do when I'm showing this cube, so that I don't reveal this hole, is I like to take my thumb and press it over the hole so that I can actually almost freely, completely freely show this square and it looks com like there's nothing um, funny about the square. So then you've got this ball. Now this one also turns inside out, it's got a big hole in it. And you can put other balls in there if you wanted to, but this wasn't about that, it was about a uh, joining together and, and growing 
administrator say, you've got this. You take this out and you do the same thing. This goes in here and it turns inside out and boom, now it's bigger. And you reveal that one. And you can kind of do the same thing if you hold that like that. You can hide that big old hole. You don't want to do this because they'll probably see the hole. But it's fun anyway. All right, so hope you guys enjoy it. Have a great time. You can do it. See you later.